Meanwhile, our reporter Evelyn Tingma has been to some public and basic schools and senior high schools as well here in Accra and reports most teachers have resumed uh, work. We are still talking about the teachers' strike and as you may be aware, yesterday the Industrial and Labour Court ordered the striking teachers to go back to their classrooms. Now, we are visiting quite a number of schools in Accra here to find out if the teachers have gone back to their classrooms. We are here at the Kanda Cluster of Schools and here I must say that quite a number of teachers have resumed work. And this was confirmed by some of the students. Have your teachers come to school today? Yes, but some of them did not come. Those who have come, are they teaching you? No, no. no. They say I come to do exams, so they are working on the papers. So what are people doing in school? We are not doing anything. We are waiting for our lunch. After lunch, I will go. Okay, so are you prepared for the exams? Yes. yes. Now, all public, basic and junior high schools are expected to vacate next week Thursday. That is on the 19th of December. But here at the Kanda Classroom Schools, examinations are yet to begin. Now, teachers tell us that even if they are able to conduct the examinations, they may not be able to mark the exam papers and give the reports to the students to take home. At the Nima Classroom Schools, some students were undertaking their end-of-term examinations. We also went to the Accra Senior High School. Over there, students were in the classrooms, but school authorities wouldn't give us much information but to tell us that the students are having their examination. We also went to the St. Thomas Aquinas Senior High School, but the only information we got was that the Form 3 students are having their mock examination. It looks as if the teachers are back to the classrooms, and we will keep you posted on this particular development. Evelyn Tengma, TV3 News, Accra. Right, so let's go to Takradi. Our correspondent, William Peters, is joining us on the telephone line with some update from there too. Uh, good afternoon. Thank you for your time. So as you may have heard from Evelyn Tingma in Accra, the Kanda cluster of schools and surrounding schools, most teachers are back. Is that the same with Takradi and the areas you visited? Yeah, unfortunately, uh, the situation is not the same here in Takradi. I visited quite a number of schools and... A particular example is that the Reverend of Sipinanko Junior High School. And the school is totally closed. There wasn't even a single student nor teacher around. All the classes were shut. The cage to the school was also shut. And I also went to uh, Fijai Senior High School. That was where I witnessed that some of the uh, Form 2 students were writing their mock exams. They are writing their social studies exams. And it was NAVCO personnel and some national service personnel who were supposed to guide them through the examination. But the teachers were in there. I spoke to uh, the headmaster of the school, and he told me that the teachers are not back from their strike action. So he has engaged the national service personnel as well as that of NASA to help supervise with activities at the mm. school. So almost the majority of the schools have been services quite about five or so schools, and no teacher was at post, as I speak to you. Very interesting. I mean, I want to understand, uh, do you know, or have you been able to get information from the teacher unions, whether the information has reached down to every teacher at the regional levels? Yeah, I called the regional boss of uh, NAT, uh, and according to him, the directive from uh, NLC, he told me that NLC doesn't have the, 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 the right to tell them to go back to post. And he, he was saying that they are hiding behind the court for them, uh, for them to go back to post. But they have even uh, issued a case to their lawyers for the lawyer to go through if it is right for them to go back. So until they hear from their lawyers, they, are, they wouldn't go back to, to, to their mm. classrooms. And uh, were you able to, for example, interact with some of the affected students uh, to, get their, to get their reactions or something? I could just ask that most of the schools I visited, the schools were totally shut. Nobody was around, with the exception of Pijai Senior High School which was being supervised by the NAPCO and other personnel. But unfortunately, the head teacher didn't permit us to uh, grant an interview with the student. What the information he gave was that he has allowed the, or engaged national service personnel as well as that of NAPCO to supervise the public who are writing their social studies as well. Right. Uh, thank you. We're grateful for that uh, update. Thank you very much, uh, William Peters. Benjamin William Peters, our correspondent from the Western Region. Let's